Nintendo, what the actual heck? Now I'm serious, what the actual heck? Why? <laughs> so, if you haven't heard the latest news, the latest thing Nintendo is doing to show how evil they are, they are now suing two sites, two ROM sites, a hundred, a hundred, over, I think it was, I think they said 150 million per game and two million, 200 million per, cup, per, um, franchise being used. These are, and these are, oh my god, Nintendo, I, I'm done. I'm done with Nintendo, I'm sorry, but it's clear, it's clear to me. It is clear as day is, as grass is green, as water is blue, and the sky is freaking up, up high. Nintendo is becoming EA. There's no excuse. There's nothing left. They are literally becoming EA. They are literally scratching. At, they are cry, grabbing for every ounce of money they could get. Because again, look how ridiculous this is. It's for ROMs. Have you ever heard of Microsoft suing over ROMs? Have you ever heard Sony suing over ROMs? No. No, it's always Nintendo. It's always Nintendo that does this bullcrap. And I'm sorry, I'm done with it. I'm officially done. Because this is all Nintendo does. This is all they've ever done. All they've ever done. This is what they do. They freaking don't understand what the fans want, and then when the fa when fans start making the own, their own things that they want, Nintendo comes and they shut it down. And then rather than taking advantage of it and actually going to start doing what the fans want, they continue to sit on their butts. Like Michael, like Nintendo, you said yourself, Virtual Console is dead. The Wii U is out of cycle. 3DS is soon to be making its way out of out of the light, its life cycle as well. All you have is a Switch. And you won't do first console on Switch. Meaning Virtual Console is dead as of the, as of now. It is dead. It is not coming back with Switch. And yet, you have, you think you have the right. I just can't take it. I literally cannot take it. You, I'm not even willing to f buy Fire Emblem at this point. Because I don't want to support Nintendo at this point. Because Nintendo has done everything. With ever since the Switch came out, it has done everything it could possibly do to get wrong, and people keep freaking s just accepting it and going with Nintendo. And I'm s and I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm done, I'm done with Nintendo. This has gone too far. They are going way too far with this. Because if they succeed, then what's to stop them from suing every single site and removing and game ROMs removed altogether? It's like. Nintendo is this pet, this petty. They don't, they want you to only be able to buy games from their site, but the problem is, you can't buy freaking games from their site because you know, Virtual Console is now dead. It's not coming to Switch, so you would you would essentially and they have a freaking split between certain games on the Wii U and certain games on the 3DS. So it's like, the frick do we do? You're asking us to pay. Like for people to, in order for people to get, to, to, uh, in order for people to actually get the virtual console, they want to buy a Wii U, which is not even going to have some ga game supplies for games anymore. It's all going on the Switch. I assure you that. The so Wii U, a dead console, a 3DS, a almost dead console, just to access virtual console games. That's what Nintendo expects you to do. You have to get both consoles if you haven't already, and then you have to freaking pay for them, pay for games individually, and then switch from each one. Rather than have one cut, one system with one single catalog with all these games. <laughs> it's mind numbing. It numbs my mind to even process how unbusiness knowledge and savvy you must be to. And think this is a good idea, and yet to have that position. I'm sorry, but Reggie, whoever the frick is, is in, is in, the, whoever's in charge, whoever's in charge over in Japan, 
and all the higher management, they need to step down immediately. They don't know how business works. They don't know what the customer wants. They won't. They are not willing to compromise or give the players what to give the customers what they want. And yet they will just keep coming toward them anyways, because the freaking Nintendo, because they can't be stopped, like Disney, except for the gaming. So yeah, and probably in a day or two, I'm probably gonna take my Switch down to my local GameStop and sell it and just be done with done with Nintendo altogether, because this is. This is ridiculous. This is beyond stupid and petty. Because they want us to essentially give them. Like, I want, hold on, I want to look at the current pricing for Wii U games and 3DS. Hold on. Hold so, Wii U, um. So way it was about two hundred, three DS is probably is about on one seventy, so almost four hundred dollars just to get access to virtual console. If you if you gave away or or like haven't bu if never bought a Wii U or three DS. If you're getting new to the freaking if you're a kid and you're starting to get new into the Switch and that's the first console they're now expecting you to pay $140, get two these two other consoles, and then pay for games. Because virtual console's not even free. You have to pay for their own games. Which is strands from like five to ten dollars, maybe even fifteen, I'm betting. And expect you to pay it. This is beyond like people don't want to admit it. But I can see it. I can I can just see it. I can see it. They're becoming EA. They're coming. They're becoming a triple A EA, and it's just—it makes no sense. They're—they're they're almost on top. They are literally in competition with PlayStation when they've been down the entire console season, and yet they just—they just just keep nickeling and diming, nickeling and diming, doing whatever, doing whatever they can to, sh to sh halt any and all fan stuff. Making them their single entity. It's just... It's just so unbearable. Because this is Nintendo. And they, it's... Out of all the companies that could possibly fall, it's Nintendo. It's just Nintendo is now doing it. And it's just so disappointing. Because I grew up on Nintendo. I grew up on Pokemon. I grew up on Game Boy Color. I grew up... Loving Pokemon, and now Nintendo has basically been reduced into a triple A version, a triple A game, pub, um, game develop publisher version of EA. That's what they become. Nintendo has become freaking EA, or they're st or they about to turn. Because Nintendo, if they cared about the customer, they cared about their freaking consumers, they wouldn't be doing this. They would understand. They they had a chance with the Virtual Console. They didn't do anything. And Mom's has been around for a long time. So I don't get what it makes no sense why all of a sudden they're doing it. Other than the fact that they can and they want to. And they want more money. They sold their soul. Nintendo has sold the soul of Nintendo to the devil for greed. And I'm honestly just done. I'm done with it. I'm done with Nintendo. It's just <sighs> everything Nintendo does is literally anti-consumer. Everything Nintendo does, they don't release their mainstream games on the PC. Well, I, well, m most companies don't. But again, if it's on Nintendo, if it's Nintendo, like Nintendo, like I think that's the difference. Nintendo, Nintendo, like Nintendo is the last one on this, but I'm pretty sure, like they're. Besides a few games like on Sony's and Xbox, they still have a few exclusives, but even then, Sony, I mean, Xbox has the Microsoft Store. The people can still play on PC, it's just that they have to do all this crap for um, PC. But again, it's like, they on it. I'm sure that um, Sony's probably thinking about it. Nintendo is still maintaining itself on just 
on its own. It's not advanced, it's not making its own PC thing, it's not doing any of that, it's just, it tells on its own. I am freaking depressed now, like, my god. Just seeing that, just, it was the final nail. It was like the final nail for me on right now I should support Nintendo. Because that goes to show, you either buy stuff for Nintendo, or you don't, period. Nintendo doesn't have it any other way. You don't get to try stuff, you don't get to do stuff, you get to, all you, they are just staying it behind, they, they are starting down every other option for fans, and basically having, and then staying in front of them all, and have their hands out, wanting money. Wanting your money, that's literally how low Nintendo has sunk. Despite the fact that the Switch has been ultra successful, and I don't understand why Nintendo is doing this, other than the fact they want all the money. They want all the money. That's that's the only reason. Nintendo is not satisfied with what it's getting. It wants more and more and more, and it's never going to be enough. That's sort of when you realize the company is literally gone gone. They are too far gone to be saved. All that's left now is for people to start realizing this, taking arms, and just letting Nintendo burn. Because even if they say they get better, and if they do, they're just, as soon as they get the, the consumer's trust back, they're just going to immediately go back to doing this stuff again. I'm not dealing with it. I'm not dealing with it. This is probably, like, I'm probably even going to have to change my background pick. Or, I try, I'll, I'll try and get in contact with a friend of mine and see if she can't work something out with me. Or maybe I'll even have, to, I might even just use my a banner or something, I don't know. Point is, this is the last time you'll probably see this, because I don't even want to show Nintendo stuff. I may be the most unlucky Lakayo, but just, God, Nintendo, what have you done with yourself? But yeah, that's basically it. Uh, you guys were hoping to see Fire, um, Fire Emblem Echoes or another Fire Emblem game with any more Pokemon games for me. Uh, this is basically me saying, no, I'm done with Nintendo, I can't freaking, I'm not keep doing, I'm not keep, I'm not, blah, I'm not doing this anymore. Nintendo has shown their hand, and I can see it clear as day, they do not care about the consumer, they just care about the money. And that's not gonna fly in my book. That's not gonna fly. You wanna do that, you wanna do that? Fine, but I'm not buying from you. I'm not doing your, with your crap. I have, there's other games I can go play. This my this Xbox, this Sony, this PC, gaming does not revolve around you. You revolve around gaming as a whole. And right now, you be, you believe that you're the center of attention, and everything, everything that people try to do is wrong, and they must pay you to get anything. Because again, like if this was the case, if Sony and Microsoft had the same in, uh, mindset, they would have stopped ROMs altogether. But they don't. I haven't, I've never looked into it, but if you looked, no, I don't even need to. Because again, Microsoft, I mean, Sony and Microsoft actually do, you know, backwards compatibility. They do freaking virtual console. They do this, and yet Nintendo doesn't. And Nintendo keeps making a full of itself. So, yeah, again, no pay for Nintendo. They, they've done this to themselves. Had they just continue on virtual console... Things would have gone better. People would not would wouldn't have to rely on actually, you know, seeing these sites to, in order to get some of the old school Nintendo games. But no, Nintendo's late trip said no. We're not. We don't want virtual console. Rather than make it easy for everyone, they choose to make it harder because they expect you to pay more. It's just it's annoying. It's all. God dang it. <sighs> So yeah, um, expect me to probably change my name in a few days, because it's just, I don't, this is just, I don't want to even look at my profile back anymore, just, just seeing Pokemon just reminds me of Nintendo and how much they just ruined themselves for me. But yeah. That's about wraps it up. Again, if you're here, if you've been here just for like po waiting for Pokemon or more final game to play, I'm sorry, but we're done with that. I'm not going back to Nintendo. This is basically the final straw for me.
I'm I'm key to all videos up again. As of now, no longer going to do with Nintendo stuff. Just I'm done with Nintendo. I'll, I'll bring it up every once in a while if they ever do. If I ever see he needs to do stuff, stupid stuff. But as of me doing actual Nintendo stuff or making videos about or making videos uh, or let's plays of Nintendo games, yeah, no, that's done. That's over. They they're not getting any more freaking footage or whatever from me. That's this is the honest all. You had this coming, Nintendo. You could have stopped it. You didn't. No no pity from me, for me because you could have stopped this easily. Anyways, that's gonna about it. Um, again, expect probably a name change, some changing to the borders and stuff. Within a few days, again, I'm just done with Nintendo and I'd rather change my channel to stuff that isn't Nintendo. But yeah, that's basically it. Thank you guys for watching and see you guys next time where we don't, hopefully, don't have to talk about Nintendo. We actually have a like, a bad, a bad, a bad of things. But yeah, see you guys then.